excited and looking forward to the 19th season here at IUP. Uh, we have a uh, probably the biggest rebuilding situation that we've had in a long, long time. Uh, but it, uh, there's a lot of enthusiasm and I think we have a lot of good, young, talented players. Uh, there's four freshmen, three transfers, seven new guys, and I expect all seven of those guys to, to play and get on the floor. Uh, we're uh, hoping that uh, Dallas Dillard, who I think was a, an all-league type of player, uh, recovers from his knee surgery at ACL tear last December. And so we're also looking to add him into that mix. Um, Demir Brooks is probably the uh, most experienced guy coming back, and that's, that's less than 10 minutes a game. But he's made some nice strides over the summer, and I'm excited about uh, where he's at. I think he's blossoming into a very good uh, PSAC player. Uh, another veteran coming back is uh, Sarp Furton, and uh, Sarp is a uh, plays good minutes as a freshman, and he's a very uh, uh, hard nosed, playing aggressive uh, uh, athlete. He plays kind of combination guard for us. So that, along with uh, a couple transfers that uh, stand stand out, we have Luke Triggs from uh, Mercyhurst that. Uh, played good minutes and was productive up at there. At, uh, he's, he's an inside player. Uh, and then we have, <clears throat> excuse me, Christian Moore, who uh, was from New Hampshire, uh, transferred in from New Hampshire after playing there for two years. And uh, we're looking for a big year out of Christian uh, as one of our premier guys, I would say. Um, this is the first time in a long time we haven't had a first or second team all-conference player back. So it's a new experience. And then, uh, uh, we have an Alfonso Pickens. He's also he played at Gannon a few years ago and then was at junior college. So those are the three transfers. And then we have four freshmen who uh, we're uh, certainly looking uh, for their development and all four are going to play. And all four I think are capable at this point in their careers uh, to make a good contribution to trying to play championship basketball. Did you want to touch on your opening weekend? The opening weekend, Charleston and Glenville were going on the road. We had a tournament scheduled at home, and uh, for the second straight year, one of the team's schools closed down, so Notre Dame closed down, and then uh, Mercyhurst went Division One, so that went there went our classic. Uh, so we're, we ended up going on the road we're down Charleston, Glenville. Both of them were always uh, competitive and NCAA potential tournament type teams. So I don't really know a lot about them at this point, but uh, but we looked for that, and then we're going to go to Ashland and play Ashland and uh, Tiffin in a tournament out there. So uh, a few more road games than, uh, than we're used to. And then um, we have my uh, assistant who did a great job for four years, Ron Fadula coming, coming up north here. He's at University of South Carolina, Buford. Uh, he's starting this Division II program from scratch. This is his third year. It, it made some nice strides down there last year. And uh, that's another little bit of a highlight on our schedule.